lot, but it also means maybe he has a little more left in the tank. And also, even though he's maybe making the fight a little more than anticipated. Marquez in the traditional Mexican. He gets a little nervous. He's got to go up against a conventional fighter. And there you see Marquez two fights ago. He lost a decision that tonight. He, I never heard him say something like that. Yeah, and he's got caught with a beautiful straight left right there by Haka. Haka oh. doing work to the body, but Marquez. I punch tonight is the same as Marquez. It means we have a good, exciting fight on our hands. Hit like a ton of bricks as Pacquiao does. He fought Marquez. When we go to the corner of Haka, when they speak to Marquez, 18, landing 18 out of 54. Haka, 18 out of 8. I think that it was Marquez who did some of the hurting in that round, although. Marquez is a, a wee tad slower than he normally is, I think, because he's because he himself got caught with a right hook, even though he might have been out. Marquez. And there you see what Marquez did to tell in this fight, if Marquez can make adjustments and start to pull away. Marquez starts to dominate as the rounds go on. I don't know if he's going to be that effective. This guy seems to have his number here. I see Marquez applying a little more pressure here. Marquez showed you a little bit of the speed that he says he has left. Just a little bit. Marquez trying to... Like the style of Jim Rex Hawk, I mean, this is two guys standing... But... Like he really is trying to take this guy's head off. Both. And don't see the right hook. Marquez seems to be caught with that straight left hand. He looks vulnerable still. He is fighting a southpaw with a good straight left hand. And that's on the scorecards now. I think it's an even fight. And you saw side uh, Emmanuel Stewart and Max Kellerman. A very hard uh Bad cut when you see two heads bumped together. That's what happened. That puts Marquez in some trouble. And Marquez, you can tell, sensing he doesn't want to. The... Volley trying to, you know, get even after getting cut. And now that he's trying to. 40. Nice right hand. He lost to Freddie Norwood. Controversial. Raises his profile among the. When particularly they're excited about what after what happened with Pacquiao in the Mexican last week. Good right hand, good right hand. Marquez. Now I like down the right side of Marquez's face. You see him wiping it off. In between, firing. Big. Fellas, they can say not what we expect. First hit, because you got to split a partial round. Four to two, Marquez. Punches, and Marquez punches good with both hands. Even though he punches well, that is truly the case, I believe. I think he's, he gets hit a little bit more than he used to, but he's... Oh, nice uppercut by Marquez, and then he does... And one, and well, no. It's a second accidental headbutt. And you can see once again, Marquez wants to take matters. This ran down Mar uh, Marquez's face in a furious exchange with a determined and, and out there. Lawrence Cole telling yeah. uh, Marquez he was ahead on the score. Phone. Definitely on it. I'm very sad about it. I don't recall that thing, folks. His face is ripped open, well, how, and he wants to fight on. How could Lawrence Cole have man, when you're bleeding like that? I mean, the guys, uh, a point that was just brought to my attention. Always the the boxing guy in his life for he and his brother Raw. Oh, big left hook! No! I'm surprised. You gotta go. Great, great victory for Marquez. Jim Rex. One man way. Marquez.